Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing a video of showing all my Lord of the Rings and the Hobbit stuff. Um, I'll start off by showing you guys what I'm wearing. So this shirt is my cool story Bilbo shirt. It's a little lame, but I thought it was clever and stupid. And then I have my Eye of Sauron contacts. I think they're pretty cool and a little creepy. A lot of people think they're creepy, but I love them. <laughs> Um, and then I have quite a few things. I just thought I'd do a video on my collection. Um, I guess a lot of things that most people would have would be like the books. So of course they have the box set of uh, The Hobbit and The Lord of the Rings. And then my favorite was the um, illustration book of The Hobbit. What got me to start liking The Hobbit was actually these books because in grade 3 my teacher read it to us and uh, I actually had a crush on my teacher which made me like it even more and I probably wouldn't have liked it <laughs> if it wasn't for that. Um, so. And then I have more Lord of the Rings books. These ones are just another edition. They have uh, more artwork in them. It's pretty cool. I'll show you. Just some nice artwork and stuff. And then I have a Gandalf bot figure. <laughs> it's really cute. And some glasses. I actually have four of these, but two of them are dirty right now. So I have Gandalf and Thorin, and then I have Elrond and uh, Bilbo upstairs. <laughs> and then I have this uh, Moleskins like journal. It has smog and the gold in front. And it's pretty cool on the inside. Um, it says, please return this journal to your humble servant. I couldn't really think of anything to put there but really my name. And it says, as a reward, and then you put a reward if somebody finds it. And then, it's just blank pages where you could write stuff. But before that, it has like a bunch of quotes and pictures. So, I'll show you. Quite a few of those. Um, and then, uh, with one of the collector's editions, I believe for this one was the Return of the King, and it opens up and you could put stuff in here. Freaking awesome! And then with the Hobbit movie, I bought the collectors for that, and it came with this. I saw the riddles in the dark statue with uh, Bilbo and Gollum. What I hate is his ears a little messed up. The paint wasn't done too well. But still clean. Oh no! I'm gonna have a, a few video games. Lord of the Rings: War in the North. It's more like a side story to the games. So it doesn't really follow. It's like what's going on while the Lord of the Rings was happening. And then Lord of the Rings Lego. I find it really funny. <laughs> I'm really excited for Lego Hobbit. And then I have the Hobbit for PC. This is brutal, but so awesome. <laughs> um, then I recently got Hero Clicks. So I got the Hobbit one and then I got an extra collectible or character dude, Gollum don't really know exactly how to play it, but I thought I'd give it a shot. And then some Legos. This one I didn't do yet. And then I have the one that I already did do. Sorry if I sound a little weird, it's because I'm just getting over a cold. Okay, so it's Bilbo's house. So I built like the whole inside and then from the outside. 
I'm pretty sure it was last year, New Year's Eve, that I both had <laughs> me and my boyfriend. Um, and then of course from the movies, watching The Hobbit, I got my Legolas dude. I had a Gandalf one from the first part, but that disappeared. Same with the cup. And then of course the 3D glasses, so I got the green ones. We didn't get the limited edition ones here for the first movie. And the gray, which I only got the standard ones as well. Okay. And then I have a Hobbit pen. Nothing too exciting. It's still something. Um, of course the movies. So of course I have the Lord of the Rings trilogy. The Hobbit, The Unexpected Journey. Because Desolation of Smog isn't out yet, so I had just the regular and then um, the extended edition. And one of my favorite things is um, my Pez. It's so a collector set, so I will not open this. It's freaking awesome. <laughs> I don't care, I think I'm a loser. And then it has like, all the dudes on the back. <sighs> So, Lord of the Rings, the duel. And then I have a Hobbit board game. The Hobbit Scrabble. Um, this game's actually pretty fun. You can play it like the normal Scrabble, or they have like a, an added thing where you, if you get a Hobbit word, you get bonus. So you can make up a word like Sting for the sword or any of their names like Gandalf, Bilbo. It's kind of cool. Oh, and there's also these extra cards added to it. And then Lord of the Rings Monopoly. This is pretty cool. The horrible part is that I always beat my friends at Monopoly with every single edition that I have. I have a lot of different Monopolies. It's another obsession of mine. But with this one, I haven't won on it yet. I won every Monopoly game except for when I played this one. Alright, so I'm almost done my collection. Uh, I have three more things to show you. So first, I will show you my one ring. So it came on the chain, and then... It's a little cheesy I find but you know still awesome <laughs> and then I have my sting sword I'll show you I really wish they would have did that a little darker I don't know I think it's awesome and then it came with this little plaque to hold it on the wall with. Ah. So it would just hang like that on the wall. Alright, so last but not least I just have a poster. So that's just my map of Middle Earth. <sighs> So yeah, that's pretty much all the Lord of the Rings and Hobbit stuff that I have. Uh, so yeah, now I gotta put all this stuff back. Well, that's all I have for now, so thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye.